Hey guys! So today I'm going to show you how I'm going to organize and clean up my kitchen, my refrigerator and cabinet, and I'm also going to show you how I juice. I've been telling you guys I'm struggling with my weight issues, and so I'm going to start my workout plan off with juicing for three days. Oh my goodness, I am so embarrassed. Look at this refrigerator. Ah. Anyway, so I'm going to get it together. I went to the Dollar Tree and picked up some storage containers, so this will all be beautiful and organized in so don't worry I first start off by taking everything out of the refrigerator because that's just how I start I, I have to take everything out I need to check dates the kids throw stuff in there my husband throws stuff in there so I have to just start fresh I try to organize the refrigerator the way I use the refrigerator during the week with the top shelf being things that need to be used right away, the second shelf being like the fruits and veggies that I use on, I use often um, and the kids juices and things and then on the third shelf are any leftovers we have for the week because I just pull from that drawer and either trash it or um, warm it up. So it's a good little system in the bottom tray I use to put like fish and cheese, um, meats and cheese. So now I'm just checking dates, making sure everything um, is within date um, and not expired or it's something that you know I'll probably use for a certain dish that we really won't use again. So I just try to get rid of all that stuff. Um, there's old packets and stuff in there so I, I, I clear everything out, wipe everything down, disinfect everything and then I put them all back. So now I start with a fresh and clean refrigerator. I am so excited about this. <laughs> so now um, going in with those, after I wipe everything down, I'm gonna go in with those organizers that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. The Dollar Tree is really a great spot because everything is very, in, is always inexpensive. And um, you can really find a lot of things to help keep you organized. So I'm just gonna start by putting things back that I know we use that's within date. Also too, I, I do wash everything before I put it in the refrigerator so you see me kind of going through everything and putting everything back. So those little blue bins will really, really help keep everything color coordinated and organized in the refrigerator. So moving on guys, I'm gonna come back and show you guys the refrigerator a little bit later. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I do my juice because that's part of stocking the refrigerator. I first start off by washing all of my fruits and veggies in the sink with apple cider vinegar. Please make sure you wash all of your fruits and veggies, guys, because you have no clue what they spray on that stuff in the stores. Please do your research. Okay, so here's my juicer. I just have a you know regular juicer. So I have cucumber, kale, beets, celery, Swiss chard, pineapples, apples, and spinach. So I'm going to go ahead and juice and I have my mason jars all lined up because I am going to do a three day cleanse, uh, juice cleanse. So I have my morning, noon and night juice. I start off by juicing each vegetable and then filling the glass up with what I want it what I want to be in it for the day like in the morning time I use um, the sweet stuff for energy like the pineapples and, uh, and apples in the morning time and then in the evening I use a little bit of habanero to make it really really spicy it's it's a great um, cleanser for your blood so um, yeah if you guys want a more detailed juicing video please let me know I love doing my research on you know what's good for you how to cleanse your body how to detox let me know I'll be happy to um, do that for you guys because I really do love juicing and when I'm not juicing I crave juice it's so weird before I hated it and now it's like I've learned to love it because you know it's not always about the taste it's just really about um, the health of your body I also do another juice on the side that's what you see in the other container on the side I do um, since I'm juicing, I'm going to juice uh, for my three days and have that stocked and ready every day so I won't have to worry about being hungry. Um, and then I also make juice for the kids um, and they love it. I, I put more of the sweet stuff in there, it's like more apples and more pineapples, mangoes and stuff in there. But um, the benefit of juicing is the vegetables um, that goes that gets right into your system. So I try to, you know, keep it 
not too sweet but um, everything that you really really need for your body to sustain especially since you're gonna since I'm gonna be juicing for three full days with nothing else so I put all the juices in the refrigerator I put my husband's in the door and then I have my breakfast lunch and dinner on the second shelf so it'll all be ready for me when I need it I have some fruits and veggies so this is it guys, this is my refrigerator, it's nice and organized with the help of a little Dollar Tree and a little organization. I'm going to be juicing for the next three days so I kind of need everything in order. Um, I love the way it turned out because it's everything is accessible and easy and you can see everything. I just love the order of it now. So yeah. So moving over to my cabinet, I'm so excited because this spice cabinet used to drive me nuts. Oh my gosh, I used to hate opening this cabinet because there was no organization. So one day I decided to just get it together. So right now I'm just going to refill all of my jars. Uh, and this came from an old spice rack. I just got rid of the rack and used the jars because I really did like the jars. I just couldn't throw them in the trash. So that is it. I'm so excited about opening this cabinet now because this is the most used cabinet in the kitchen because you know it's a spice cabinet so you use it all the time when you're cooking. I love the way it turned out. I just added some string lights and some contact paper from the Dollar Tree and an old spice rack jar and I love it. So the goal this year is to be organized. <laughs> I know, I'm crazy. Anyway guys, so if you want to see how I put this cabinet together, let me know. I still do have that video. I'll be happy to put it up for you guys. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Um, Till next time, if you have any questions, leave it down in the comment section. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.